emulate, match or surpass a person or achievement, typically by imitation. Yo! Match or surpass. Working for Working on some shit. A performer, artist, actor, musician, fucking. Ah, uh, fucking madman, if you ask me. Passed away. Prince Rogers Nelson. Remember when I was a kid, I first heard about this guy. I first heard of him. I don't remember the name of the tune. I tell you, I didn't think twice about it. Why would I? Actors come, actors go. Actresses come, actresses go. Musicians. Fucking dime a dozen. You know, here was a new kid. Jumping around, carrying on. Not a thought. As time went on, get another hit that I liked. I'm not going to sit here and say I was the world's biggest Prince fan. But just hear me out. Tell you why. In my eyes, this guy was one motherfucker you had to stand up and recognize. Another hit, another hit, another hit. You know, another band came and went, another band came and went. Another actress, actress showed up, gone. Actress showed up, gone. You know, you heard a couple artists doing this, that, and everything else. You know, most of the time, and still to this day, it's still the same thing. I think the most of the lot of them are just a bunch of pretentious fucking jerk-offs. However, when I've, I find that when an, a performer or artist, because there's a difference between a fucking jerk-off actor or actress and an artist. Artist actually takes their shit a little bit more seriously. You don't find these fucking jerk offs standing on a soapbox sitting there trying to tell you their opinion and why they're so much smarter and they're so much better than you are. Oh, fuck you, fuck you. However, this fucking kid, hit after hit, walking away, see him one day be looking like this, see him the next day he's looking like some completely fucking different shit. Bunch of different styles that he put together, mostly his own. Made his own instruments, wrote his own music, wrote his own songs, recorded all his own shit. Yeah, he had a band, you know, the revolution and everything else, but he was the guy. When Prince decided to change his name to the artist formerly known as Prince, and he came up with an icon. This thing. Uh, it's upside down. Alright, sideways, but you get it. I thought to myself, God damn it. You know, I was actually liking that guy. What a fucking jerk off. Changes his name to a fucking icon. Who the fuck does that? Until I found out why. And man, let me tell you something. He became a fucking superstar in my head. Just if I could snap my fucking fingers, I'd be going. However, instantly. When I realized 
that he decided to change his name to this fucking icon, to me he became an icon. When I realized that the reason he changed his name was to go give a big go fuck yourself to the lawyers of all the fucking jerk off music executives over where's Warner Brothers or wherever fucking jerk off records were. Because those motherfuckers, all they do is buy and sell people. They use and abuse your talent. Next. Alright, what have you done for me today? Nothing. Next. They had rights to not only his music, but they actually had rights to his name. The name Prince. He could never do anything and call himself Prince again. So... He decided to not to even have a fucking name, call himself the artist formerly known as Prince to tell the music executives, go fuck yourself. And for that, I applaud that motherfucker. That is the difference between everybody else in the world and somebody that actually has a thought in their fucking head. When you hear people profess about their genius, I'm a goddamn genius. I'm this, I'm that. Rah, 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 rah. Oh, fuck them. All they are is jerk offs. Okay? Think about it. Did you ever hear Albert Einstein saying how much of a fucking genius he was? No. Stephen Hawking, you don't hear him being, I am a genius. No. Nah. No. Nah. When you're a genius, you don't need to tell the world that you're a genius. The world tells you that you're a genius. That motherfucker was a genius. Prince Rogers fucking Nelson. Little fucking spark plug motherfucker, you kick ass. Oh, and by the way, he's not dead. He's reinvented himself. He decided he wanted to become an immortal. That's how fucking genius this fucking kid is. I applaud, I salute. You will be missed, but you will be remembered. Fucking kid. Five foot two. Cast a shadow across the entire planet. How's that for fucking genius? Sick man, sick man. A world of never ending happiness. You can always see the sun at day or night. So when you call it piss off. Plant flowers. It's almost Mother's Day. Uh, you know what? Prince got pissed off. He got angry because he was getting fucked. And he came up with an idea. It worked out really well. You know what? I'm getting fucked. And I'm all pissed off. I'm angry. This goddamn spinal cord injury sucks fucking ass. I got an idea. See what you think about this. That's how you emulate somebody. Defiance, motherfucker. Worked for Prince, works for me. Maybe it should work for you.